Hello and welcome to another episode of Tips and Ideas with Ed Wallace from Midwest Landscaping, www.uniqueenvironments.com. We're here in Ventura County and we have an interesting situation here where we have a ground squirrel invasion. As you see here in this little hole here, this creative little ambitious ground squirrel has dug underneath our snake screening and uh, decided to come through anyway so he can create havoc here in the uh, on the property I've noticed uh, a couple areas down in the uh, planter bed area down below where we planted some um, gazania ground cover and at first I thought it was uh, rabbits and come to find out that uh, it wasn't a rabbit after seeing a ground squirrel scale this here um, screen I seen one ground squirrel actually go up the screen and over the top over into this other area here which is an old uh, avocado orchard with a bunch of dead avocados and this is basically luxury land for the uh, ground squirrels and other gophers and other wildlife that lives in this area but uh, I guess the ground squirrels decided to heck with this uh, snake screening and they decided to go right up under the snake screen and uh, come in to invade the property and this is a bad deal because uh, once they have a hole like that, then the purpose of the snake screen has been defeated. Because the snake screen was basically put in practically uh, a foot down in order to prevent snakes from coming in onto the property. But most snakes, they like to occupy uh, holes from gophers and ground squirrels. And so this will provide a perfect entry point for uh, a snake. So what we're going to do is utilize a product that... Um, has been very effective on gophers and the product is called gopher Goo. gopher goo it's a green gopher solution and it's a hundred percent biologically safe for the environment earth friendly it has um, a food grade polymer that is uh, that turns into a catalyst like jello once we put it in we're going to pour it in the hole and also has some ingredients in it here you go here it has some little black specks in it which is actually compost and this compost will help from the standpoint of being able to uh, re-establish the roots because the gophers are actually eating the roots but the ground squirrels are coming in on the property and they're eating plant material so what we're going to do I have uh, about a two and a half gallon bucket here we're just going to take and pour that gopher glue in here like so And then we're going to take and stir this up so that we can get this stuff activated. Then once it's stirred up and it's hydrated or activated, what we're going to do is pour this down into the hole. And what this gopher goo will do, it will basically gel up like jello. And the gophers like to maneuver through the holes with the with their pelt. And so the smoothness of the pelts help them to maneuver through the hole. So once this solution gets on their pelt, they cannot uh, maneuver through the hole. So they get gummed up and necessarily they move on to other spaces. And plus the uh, polymer actually fills the hole. So it prevents the, uh, the gophers from coming through and actually the, uh, the other animals and stuff from coming through also the um, ground squirrels and such because there is no... Uh, way they can get through this goo. So now that it's all activated up, what we'll do is pour this down into the hole. Like so. There you go. Now this goo will basically um, swell up to like about 300 size, 300 times its size you can see it kind of swelling up right now it'll swell up and what will happen is when that ground squirrel gets that stuff on his pelt he's not going to like it at all and so what's going to happen is he's going to decide to move on to other grounds and hopefully uh, this will help manage these gophers that's on this property here but uh, we're going to pour this in here I'll get some more I only had a little bit and uh, so I'm going to get some more uh, one gallon, one pound sacks of the gopher goo, and we're going to follow up and do some more 
in the different holes because we actually have some gopher holes or ground squirrel activity over on the slope over that way and also down on the other side close to the uh, swimming pool area there's some holes that are down that I think are from ground squirrels or from gophers so that's what's happening here today in Ventura we're utilizing the gopher goo if you want to find out more about this fantastic product you can go to www.gophergoo.com and uh, place an order find out more information about it it's made here in in California in Central California and uh, that's all for today but we'll be back so we can review and see how this gopher goo is doing Ed Wallace tips and ideas www.uniqueenvironments.com <laughs>